This is Farm Journal's Margie Fisher with Isaac Ferry, one of our presenters here at the 2011 Corn College. Isaac, you are speaking with the attendees today about remote data management and how that how important it is for today's farmers. Tell me, what, what were you telling them about how they can improve their data management? Basically, uh, we went through a couple different systems out there, a couple different <clears throat> new monitors and uh, pieces of equipment out there that allow you to transfer data from your desktop software, desktop locations to actual monitors in the tractor cab or in the four-wheeler in, in the truck and be able to transfer that data back and forth. So we went through a couple different products that allow you to seamlessly transfer that data back and forth. Not only prescription maps, say, to your monitor, but as applied maps and stuff like that back to the desktop to make sure that the dispatch in the, in the office is up to date with what you're doing out there as soon as you get it done. With the farmers that you work with, what do you think they, the obstacles that they encounter the most? Um, definitely data management in general for our farmers is very, very difficult. Making sure that you get your cards downloaded, make sure that you transfer the data back to your computer, make sure that you have the right files on your computer to be able to get out there. So for our guys, downloading at the end of the day, at the end of the season, there's a lot of chances there for data to be lost, data to be corrupted. So with, with some sort of seamless system where you're updating your data to your computer every night, um, every hour of every day, it, it makes it so they're not, they don't have to be so hands-on with the data management part, gets it a lot more seamless. And you can send it not only to your desktop, your fertilizer dealer's desktop, your agronomist's desktop, so they have that data as well. With the developments in Precision Ag, there's a lot more layers of data that farmers are collecting for the fields kind of walk through all the different layers and how farmers can fine-tune zone management. Well, one of the other things we're, we're seeing out there is, is, like you said, we have not only layers upon layers of data, but we have years upon years of those data as well. So um, being able to manage that data, it's it gets bigger and bigger every year. Uh, so it's harder and harder to get a grasp on that data. As we look into the future, one of the places where we actually see a huge market coming forth is in the smartphone type apps. Uh, being able to not only have all those layers in your office, in on your computer or in binders, but be able to have all that data at your fingertips. So when you walk out into a field uh, and you're seeing something out there, a nitrogen deficiency, a uh, weed problem or something like that, you can pull out your phone and you can pull up last year's yield map and see was it there last year, two years ago was it there, uh, what was my nitrogen rate, what was my variety in that particular spot. Did they hit this spot with the fungicide application or is it a skip? Did they overlap on a herbicide application? Uh, you can now, now with this seamless uh, data transition, you can take all those layers that you, you're used to looking at at the end of the season in the office or at the end of the day and you can put the, all that power at your fingertips and be able to access uh, layer upon layer uh, throughout the field, throughout the day, throughout the year and it's all at the, at the tip of your finger. With any investment in technology and obviously, you know, some labor to handle all this data, what, how would you quantify the payback of being able to manage your fields in this way? I think that the payback is huge. If you're taking time to actually collect good data, um, saving it for the end of the season to review it all, uh, is, it's good to review it at the end of the season, but you're not getting the, the most bang for your buck. So being able to take that data and look at it in season, in the field, uh, definitely makes that that data that you've already collected, the data you already have, and it puts it into overdrive. So you get the most bang for your buck out of it. I think it's it's a very small step in a system that you've already made 15 huge steps to keeping all those records. And the price of a, a phone app or, or even the price of a data plan on a smartphone is pretty cheap compared to what you're paying to collect all this data. And now it's just going to make it uh, provide you with a way to use that data in the field in real time. I think the payback's huge. Thank you, Isaac.